Hi, Mom. Yeah. No, can you pick up Chris after school? Yeah, I'm, I'm at the doctor's. Mrs. Harris? Describe your symptoms. H hang on. Stress, headaches, nausea. Well, I work on Saturdays. And how long has this been? Equanimity. Balance your lifestyle. Us. They're telling me you and I get to talk about fall fashion, right? Absolutely. All right. Well, it's, 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 the weather's beautiful. It's getting crisp, and it's time for a change in attire. What do you have for us? Yeah, absolutely. So this season at Polyvore, we're, um, we're seeing three major categories that you should be looking at um, to update your fall wardrobe. So we're going to start with apparel. Um, so denim, denim trends are always hot. Um, but instead of the skinny jean this season, we're seeing flare jeans. Uh, a crop jean and also that raw hem style jean um, this season. Also, um, off shoulder tops continue to be very hot. Uh, and um, also, in terms of uh, texture, we're seeing this season uh, velvet, uh, silk, and embroidery are very hot. Um, so, in particular, velvet dresses, um, silk bow tie blouses, and embroidered coats. Uh, okay. What about lace? I'm sorry. Is lace in there? Because that's been such a hot trend. You know, lace has been and continues to be a hot trend. It's not um, one of the most popular trends on Polyvore this season, but um, we do see it trending. It, it just isn't spiking at this point. Okay. Sounds good. Continue. Yeah. And then in terms of accessories, we're seeing mini backpacks are trending, and it's a great alternative to the tote bag. Um, and also choker necklaces, I think this is honestly because we're seeing it on every single celebrity from Taylor Swift to the Kardashians. And then over the knee boots are hot right now. Um, and that used to be kind of a tricky trend. I think the way that people are wearing it now is in kind of a, a low heel style with a pair of cute jeans and maybe an oversized sweater. Yes, let me ask you, so you're telling us, or, or fashion is telling us, celebrity set the trends? You know, it's a kind of a mix. I mean, we see things on the runway, and then we see them in real life, and then, you know, we see them on celebrities, and I think that that's definitely influential. It's like, uh, it's like seeing them on, um, I think the more that we see them, the more, the more we see them on um, people like you and me. It just gives us more um, ways and ideas to style these kinds of trends. And I think the choker necklace is honestly something that came back from the 90s and we've been seeing it on the models like Gigi and Kendall and then we've been seeing it on celebrities and it kind of filters down and everyone's kind of trying to figure out a way to incorporate it into their own wardrobe. Okay, you talked about uh, boots, heel smaller you say? Yeah. Also choose? I think that for over the knee boots, if you want to try that trend and you haven't done it before, personally I would go for an over the knee boot with kind of a lower heel just because it's a little easier to wear from day to evening. Um, it's a little more appropriate and then you can wear it with a pair of jeans and a cute sweater or a cute blouse. Um, if you want to wear an over the knee boot with a higher heel, you can for sure. Um, it might be a little bit dressier look and maybe not um, as easy to put, sort of pull off in the office. Okay. Are shoes coming down or are shoes continuing to go up? I don't think they go any higher, but... Uh, <laughs> uh, I think that they, you know, it kind of is a personal preference, but um, I definitely, for me, I, I like to wear a lower heel just because I, I do live in San Francisco. It's easier to walk around the city, and if you want to take them from day to evening, it's just a lot easier. Okay, I like that. I really like that shoes that actually you can walk in. That yeah, makes sense. exactly. Doesn't it make sense to me, but people walk in high, high shoes. I know, okay. I know. What is the one trend that we should have in our closet then? Honestly, if it was me, I would, I would go for velvet. Velvet this season is a really hot texture, um, and you can wear it in a dress, and you can take that dress right through the holidays and add a pair of sandals and a cute clutch. Um, velvet uh, blouses, velvet blazers, um, velvet everything. Velvet boots are trending, so I would definitely invest in like a beautiful velvet piece. Okay, Amy Wicks, fashion expert. Where would you send my audience online to see these trends? Yes, please. Um, for more information on how to style these trends and for all the trends for fall, go to polyvore.com.
Thank you so much. They say you were the fashion expert. You lived up to your reputation. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you.